Lexus RCF receives adaptive suspension dampers and Scout GPS link capability for 2017. We recommend when it comes to the 2017 Lexus RCF, your choice of trim level is simple, there's no choice because there's but one trim level. There's a handful of optional packages, however, of which we particularly recommend the premium package for its useful convenience items. Though the performance package sounds tempting, it's pricey, and its active differential imparts a synthetic feel to the car's handling, even as it produces quicker lap times. We say skip it because this is not a track-focused car anyway. Trim levels and features the 2017 Lexus RCF is offered in a single configuration, so if it has piqued your curiosity, the only thing left to do is to decide on optional equipment. The premium package is our favorite extra, it bundles a lot of the best stuff such as automatic wipers, LED headlights, heated and ventilated seats, parking sensors and rear cross-traffic alert. Audiophiles will understandably be tempted by the 17-speaker Mark Levins in premium audio system. You might think we'd automatically recommend the performance package, but the RCF is one case where we suggest you reconsider. For its intended purpose of providing a sporty experience on the street, the RCF is just fine without this expensive add-on. Trim tested each vehicle typically comes in multiple versions, although trim levels share many aspects. The ratings in this review are based on our full test of the 2015 Lexus RCF 5.0 liters V8, 8-speed automatic. Note, since this test was conducted, the current Lexus RCF has received the notable addition of adaptive suspension dampers. Our findings remain broadly applicable to this year's RCF. Driving rating the numbers on the track don't match the way this car feels on the street. The RCF is some 500 pounds heavier than a BMW M4 and drives the part, so its 467 horsepower V8 is blunted to some extent. The transmission is slow to downshift, and the engine needs revs to thrive. Excellent brakes, though. Comfort rating it's hard to get over the RCF's poor ride. The seats are exceptionally built, and it's not loud inside as you'd expect from a Lexus, but they're rough. Jittery ride is out of place for a car in this class. Interior rating design and materials are excellent, perhaps class leading. Usability is poor, however, as is visibility. Space for passengers and stuff is merely okay. Utility rating with a smallish trunk, limited cabin storage options and a fixed in place rear seat back, practicality takes a hit. Long term road test to learn more about the Lexus RCF of this generation. Read our updates from a full year of living with a 2015 Lexus RCF. We cover everything from seat comfort to round-world fuel economy. Please note that the 2017 Lexus RCF differs from our long-term RCF in that the suspension has been updated with adaptive dampers. It's the same generation, though, so most of our observations still apply. Read long-term test other vehicles to consider 2017 BMW M4 Coupe $66,200 2017 Mercedes-Benz Class AMG C63 $67,000 Compare similar vehicles.